What's good YouTube? So in today's video, we're going to be talking about rapper 50 Cent defending Megan Thee Stallion and this in her cameraman, or I should say her ex-cameraman, because he filed a lawsuit against her claiming that he was forced to watch Megan have sex with another female. I think it was two females, but either way, the cameraman is not too happy. I guess he's having like emotional distress and all that shit from watching Megan and another female allegedly get it on, right? So like I said, he's filing a lawsuit, but 50 Cent is not too fond of this whole situation and he's actually dissing the cameraman. Y'all know 50, he's gonna speak how he feels in relation to these cases and all that shit, right? So y'all can let me know what y'all think about what 50 cent is saying and also don't forget to like this video guys i'm going to be reading an article this will give you a better understanding as to what's going on anyways make sure y'all subscribe to the channel um yeah make sure y'all share the video as well and with that being said let's get to this article all right so the article is saying 50 cent ridicules megan the stallion's cameraman over frivolous lawsuit 50 cent says the lawsuit brought by a former cameraman is frivolous as he thinks the past employee should have been happier to see megan the stallion and another woman making out on tuesday nbc reported that the savage rapper was being sued by her former cameraman for harassment creating a hostile environment and eventually firing him after she allegedly forced him to watch her having sex with another woman in 2022. Documents quoted by The Blast saying that the cameraman Emilio Garcia worked as a cameraman for the rapper starting in 2018 as a part-time contractor before working with her full-time. He left her employment in 2023 citing the main reason being the way Megan treated him after he witnessed the incident with another woman in Spain. Garcia says he has worked on a tour with Megan in June 2022 in Ibiza, Spain. He had accompanied Megan on a night out and while in the SUV with three other women, he witnessed the incident. Suddenly, Stallion and one other woman started having whoopee right beside me, the lawsuit says, adding he couldn't get out of the car as it was both moving and he was in the middle of nowhere in a foreign country. He claims the incident left him embarrassed, mortified and offended throughout the ordeal. The cameraman also claimed that Megan warned him never to discuss the incident and she also criticized and fat shamed him calling him a fat h nbc quotes garcia as stating i felt uncomfortable i was kind of frozen and i was shocked at kind of just be the overall audacity to do this right beside me elsewhere in the lawsuit he also claimed that megan fat shamed him on several occasions and claimed she was a hypocrite for someone who was body positive he claims that his employment status also changed dramatically with him earning money per task rather than a flat monthly salary he was eventually let go in a letter from rock nation garcia claims that his employment with megan has impacted his mental health and he's seeking damages for mounting anxiety depression and physical distress due to work in a toxic work environment in the meantime 50 cent chimed in on the lawsuit report sharing his opinion that he felt the lawsuit should have been thrown out this cameraman and the lawyer who made this claim should be punching the head i'm sorry Two women start making out, I'm not offended. This case is thrown out of my court, 50 Cent wrote on Instagram. Garcia is represented by Ronald Zambrano, the attorney who represents a group of dancers who have made similar allegations against Lizzo in a lawsuit filed last august so that's what's going on guys what do y'all think about 50 cent saying that the judge should just throw this case out because you know if two females um you know started to do whatever in front of him kissing or whatever right he's gonna i guess enjoy it but what about if it's a female judge who doesn't endorse those type of stuff you know i mean not everyone likes those type of things you get me um yeah but what do y'all think do y'all even think that this story is real and what do y'all think about this guy filing such a lawsuit you know obviously a lot of men would like to see stuff like that but there's also persons who you know obviously don't want to see stuff like that so you know it is what it is guys but let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section and thanks for watching the video don't forget to like share and subscribe and i will see you all in the next video stay safe peace